Welcome everyone to Know Before You Go, a broadcast briefing powered by JSA. I'm your host, Dean Perrine, EVP of Client Strategy and Success at JSA, and Know Before You Go is the show that covers everything attendees should have on their radar, from insider talking points to conference logistics before attending the next big industry event. And today is no different. Today's briefing will be focused on Data Cloud USA taking place September 17th and 18th in Austin, Texas. And here to talk about the upcoming conference is Broad Group's Lottie Westerling and Joe Howarth. Lottie and Joe, welcome to Know Before You Go. How's it going? Yeah, absolutely. And um, thank you so much for having us. Yeah, I'd just like to start by saying thank you very much for having us on today. You you bet, Joe, you bet. Let's go ahead and jump right in really quickly, Lottie. This question uh, will be for you. Um, I am really looking forward to attending. I will be there speaking uh, at the event, and I'm very excited about that. But maybe for our viewers, uh, maybe share some of the highlights that you have planned for this year's show. We're really looking forward to be returning to Austin for the biggest Data Cloud USA yet. Um, to start off with, we've got our Talent in Tech initiative, which focuses on bridging the talent gaps in the industry um, and gives young talents a chance to connect with executives from Microsoft, Equinix and more. Um, for this, we've got a pre-event uh, welcome reception taking place. And then we've also got a lunch taking place on day one at the event. And um, we've also got a golf day on the pre-event day sponsored by Cola Energy. Um, this is actually fully sold out now. So I think it's going to be a really exciting um, few games of golf. Um, and we've also got our digital infra leaders report, which will be shaped by the insights of both the conference program and our leadership summit that takes place on the pre-event day. Um, so do keep an eye out for this after the conference has taken place. And um, so to make sure you don't miss out. Uh, very, very cool. I, for one, will not be embarrassing myself on the golf course. Uh, so no, no worries there. But uh, there, it seems like the, you've got a packed agenda. So why don't we talk a little bit about what that agenda looks like um, here in, uh, in September? Yeah, so artificial intelligence and powering for these workloads will be at the forefront of many of the conversations across the two days. Um, we'll be discussing design implications and where modular solutions might be helpful in um, accommodating for these um, new AI workloads. Um, and then also where power needs to be reconsidered um, given the availability of power across um, across the country um, what new solutions uh, can be leveraged to be able to meet this demand um, and the key questions around when technologies like SMRs might be able to enter the mainstream. Um, we've also recently announced that Joe Carver will be delivering our opening keynote um, and he'll be discussing how we have to rethink capacity, space, power density and architecture um, for data centres to be able to stay ahead in this period of rapid change. Um, on that topic of speakers, we've got a huge number of first time speakers for Data Cloud USA this year from NVIDIA, Grok, Microsoft and Google, just to name a few of them. So it's going to be really interesting to be able to hear these fresh and new perspectives um, as we're experiencing such an exciting time in the data infrastructure industry. Yeah, no, absolutely. Um, you know, the the more the more we get into uh, kind of AI development and employment and like uh, or deployment in a uh, in a meaningful way, the more we realize that those that infrastructure is is going to have to kind of keep pace with the in, with the uh, the innovation of the actual uh, actual technology that it houses. So lots of really really cool things there. It sounds uh, very very relevant uh, to to the time. So very cool, um, Joe. This question is going to be for you. Uh, you already uh, dropped a couple of names of companies uh, that are going to be there and some really, really great keynote speaking. But Joe, maybe talk to um, talk to us a little bit about some of the networking opportunities at the event this year. Um, really excited to discuss Data Cloud USA with you and to welcome everyone to Austin in September. It's going to be brilliant. Um, in terms of networking, so as Lottie mentioned, we've got our golf day hosted by Kohler Energy. Um, it's now fully subscribed, so you wouldn't need to play um, anyway, Dean. So we're all good on that front. It's been super popular. That'll be on the 16th of September, so the pre-event day uh, at the Fazio Canyons Golf Resort, which is on the same resort that, that the Omni, which the event's being held at, is at. So that, yeah, the first time we've done something like this, we're trying to make the uh, event more of an event rather than just a sort of conference. So that's enabled us to sort of do that for this year. So really, really excited for that. 
Also on the pre-event day, the 16th of September, we'll have our talent and tech reception. So that will be welcoming the new, the young students into the industry and uh, people that have, have only been in the industry a couple of years now. So they'll be there for the welcoming reception of that. And then following this, uh, we'll have our welcoming drinks reception for everyone who's registered for the event. So that's your first opportunity really to begin to network and meet everyone that's going to be attending the event. Then on the actual event days themselves, the 17th and the 18th, we'll have the content and exhibition opening. So we'll have this sort of relaxed style exhibition area, stands around the outside, networking lounges in the middle for attendees that have booked those to host their meetings from, and our networking lunches and coffee breaks sort of dotted in between the, the content so that you can have a chance to, to network there, as well as our day one drinks reception to cap off the first day. Uh, yeah, so we're really, really excited just to be back in Austin it's a wonderful place and it's really our home now and it has been for the last two years. So this will be our best, biggest and best event yet. So we're expecting around 600 attendees. So yeah, it's, it's, it's set to be, it's set to be a real, real success, a real good one. And I think everyone's really going to have a great time and uh, it's really going to be worth attending for everyone. Austin really is a cool place. I was very excited when the uh, the powers that be here at JSA said that I was going and speaking, so I'm very excited about that. So it sounds like a lot of really, really great event-specific um, networking opportunities um, here in Austin. So my favorite question, and Joe, this is we're going to stick with you, is what are the three biggest tips that attendees, that you can give attendees getting ready to attend uh, Data Cloud in Austin? Yeah, of course. So my three tips for the event, the first one would be to make sure you downloaded our swap card app. So that's the sort of event networking app called swap card, uh, which is where you have access to all of the attendees that are at the event, all of the agenda sessions. So it's main, it's the main hub for the information on the event. Really, you can reach out and you book, book your meetings in through the app. I always say to people that are looking to attend the event that a lot of the work has to be done prior to the event in order for the event to be a success. So make sure you're using the swap card app. Once you're registered to the event, you'll be prompted to download swap card. Um, and from there, you can begin to book your meetings in. You can also obviously see the amount of the attendees that are there. And off the back of that, you can book meetings in separately from swap card. But yeah, make sure you've got swap card is my first tip. Second tip would be to plan your sessions and agenda ahead. So Lottie's just gone through a little bit of information on the agenda in terms of the sessions that we're hosting. And we've got some really, really interesting topics and some brilliant speakers on there as well. So it's worth planning which sessions you're going to see, which sessions you, you, you might not be going to see. So you you know where there's going to be a gap in your in your agenda planning. So that would be my, my sort of main te second tip. And my third tip would be to attend the drinks receptions. The setting, as I've said before, is amazing. In Austin, it's at the Omni, Omni Barton Creek Resort and Spa. Lovely views over the golf course. We're going to have two different drinks receptions, the welcome reception and then the day one reception. So that's your opportunity to sort of chat with everyone and catch up and um, make sure you bring your sunscreen as well. Outstanding, Joe. Thank you. Also, stay hydrated. If my mom were uh, on the on the broadcast with us today, she'd be saying make sure that you stay hydrated. Um, so excellent. And Joe, um, last question for you, and then we will turn it right back over to Lottie. Um, any final closing thoughts? What What are you most excited about? Main thoughts from from my side. Uh, we're just really, really excited to be back in Austin. Um, looking forward to welcoming everyone to the Omni in a couple of weeks' time. So, yeah. Looking forward to welcoming you all there. And thanks very much for having us on, Dean. Thank you so much for having us. Um, make sure you all reserve your passes now and download our networking app and get booking those all important meetings. And I really look forward to seeing lots of you in Austin um, in September. Lottie and Joe, we really appreciate you sharing the insider tips for making the most of our time at Data Cloud USA. And to get all the details to prepare for Data Cloud USA, you can visit datacloud, one word, hyphen USA.com. That's datacloud hyphen USA.com. And during the conference week, use hashtag Data Cloud USA. We've also got a QR code here on the screen right now to make it a little easier to get to the event page. You can also use discount code JSA10 to save on the registration. And be sure to tune in September 17th and 18th as I broadcast, that's right, me personally will be broadcasting, broadcasting from Data Cloud USA in Austin on JSA TV Live. You'll be able to find exclusive live interviews and conference coverage on JSA's YouTube channel and link in page. And that is it. So thank you for tuning in to Know Before You Go. And as always, happy networking.